안녕하세요. This is Jia. These days the weather is getting cooler and the autumn vegetables such as napa cabbage and mushroom is perfect. It's juicy, so fresh and today I want to introduce to you a delicious hot pot. 배추 소고기 전골. We will start from making a broth. Soak a piece of dried seaweed in a boiling hot water for 30 minutes. This dried seaweed is called Tashima in Korean or Kombu in Japanese. These are Korean beef hanu slices. These are cut into 2 ml thick, which is quite thin. Season it with salt and pepper. If you cannot get this thin beef, you can just put the beef in the freezer for an hour and a half and it will turn solid and it's much easier to cut. Then cut the meat as thin as possible. This is small napa cabbage called albechu. It's softer and thinner than big napa cabbages. Remove the root part and carefully split each leaf. When using regular napa cabbage, I recommend to use only the inner leaves. Wash them and drain. Cut the green onion into inch-sized pieces. This is optional. I like to add bok choy to this hot pot. These are already washed, so just remove the root. Now, let's stack the ingredients. Lay one napa cabbage leaf on the board. Place bok choy leaves on the top of the cabbage, then top with one or two slices of beef. Stack the leaf of cabbage like this, so that it tastes, stays stable. Repeat the process. You need to check the depth of the pot that fits the veggie and the meat. Normally, it's made into five layers. We'll cut it now. Use skewers to cut the piles of cabbages stably. Place mung bean sprouts to the pot and spread. Remove the skewers and carefully place it to the pot. Work it from the outer edge up to the center. And leave some spaces in the middle of the pot and add the oyster mushrooms and green onion. Season the broth with light soy sauce and some salt. It shouldn't be too salty. Add it to the pot. The broth shouldn't cover all the ingredients. So pour the broth only quarter of the depth of the ingredients because the vegetables will make some broth as well. And we're going to bring it to a boil. Meanwhile, let's make a dipping sauce in a bowl. Combine dark soy sauce, rice vinegar, water, and Korean mustard. Mix it well to dissolve the mustard. The hot pot is boiling. Let's skim off the foam to make clear broth. This hot pot, once it's boiling, reduce the heat and cook for additional 5 to 10 minutes. The beef, they're thinly sliced and the napa cabbage, they quickly fully cook them. So watch out and when it's done, I like to just serve as it is in the middle of the table and serve with the dipping sauce that we made along with a small bowl. So let me taste one bite. Mm. The balance of salty, sour and the delicious sort of umami from the broth is just perfect. Thank you for watching. See you next time.